parked among the beach huts in St. Leonard's is the Skylark. If you look close enough, you can just make it out. It's the Weller family's new home. I'm Brian. I'm Dawn. I'm Amy. I'm Alex. I'm Sam. In the spring of 2006, they sold their property in Oxfordshire and began an 18-month project to convert a double-decker bus into a mobile home. Do you miss any of the sort of home comforts that you had in your old house? Um, no, we've got everything that we used to have in the old house. We've got a um, fully fitted kitchen, a coffee machine, cooker, full-size fridge and even the washing machine. The idea was to use the bus to travel across Europe and beyond with no fixed timetable or destination. Well, I've always been considered a little bit eccentric in my ways, but I, and saying that, you know, I tried to keep my feet firmly on the grain, but it was something we've always wanted to do. Travel was a thing that we wanted to do before Amy was born, or just after Amy was born, and we knew we moved out to Greece, in Crete, in fact, you know, and we didn't do it, and we, I think we always felt like we should have done it. <laughs> The children, who are all pulled out of school, have home tutoring every day for a couple of hours. Their parents want them to gain as much life experience as possible. Alex has already embraced the outdoors and spends as much time as he can fishing. Do you like being outside? Yeah, it's, it's really cool out here and there's like all the sort of stuff that I like go looking on the beach, see what's been washed up and that. When you're both in the bus, what do you do? Uh, well, I just fight and play and... Fight? You've, you managed to find space to fight in here. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, there's not much room upstairs. That's why Dad has to sleep downstairs. Having had a taste of life in France last year, the family are now off to Ireland. And you can keep up to date with their adventures because everyone on the bus is keeping a blog. Ashatana, 5 News. Ashatana.